the night of the shooting star. Staravia, Mudkip, and Meowth are gazing at the night sky from atop a small round hill. The stars are so beautiful. There are so many stars. I want just one. A line of light suddenly cuts across the night sky through the stars. Swish! Twinkle, twinkle, twinkle. Staravia excitedly says, Ooh, a shooting star! Do you think it landed nearby? Mudkip and Meowth want to know where the shooting star landed. Let's go and find the shooting star! All three Pokémon come down from the hill right away. Staravia searches a tall rocky mountain. Mudkip searches the beach. Meowth searches many streets. They all look very hard for the fallen shooting star. When they all return to the top of the hill, it seems they have found many different stars. A piece of glass, the lid to a metal can, a flower, a spider web. Are any of these the shooting star? It seems that some rather odd stars have gotten mixed in. Wiggle, wiggle, mumble, mumble. Did the pink star just move? The star that Staravia brought from the Rocky Mountain was actually a sleeping Cleffa. Cleffa, waking up in a strange place, begins to cry. The three other Pokémon hurry to return Cleffa back to its Rocky Mountain home. They do their best to climb the steep mountain path, heading for the top of Cleffa's Rocky Mountain. They've climbed very high. On the far side of the rocks, something is faintly glowing. This must be the top. On the far side of the rocks, many Clefairy and Clefable are waiting for Cleffa's return. It looks like a great many stars have gathered here. They didn't find the shooting star, but they did make some new friends who sort of look like stars. Even the once dark and scary mountain path turned into a fun journey home.